Hey everybody on YouTube, this is, uh, we just bought a camper, um, this is my Honda Pilot, the camper only weighs 2,400 pounds, we did a lot of research because my Pilot can only carry 3,500, so let's go on up here, if you look over here you see I'm not sitting down too low, my wheels are fairly steady, and the reason for that is I went out and bought a uh, equalizer hitch. And what that does is it hooks on with this big hitch there. Then we've got these rods that go back and attach to the frame. And what that does is it distributes the weight very evenly on the wheels. So I'm not sinking down real low. And this is a 1996 Aerolite. It's fully enclosed. It's not one of those uh, hybrids that pop out. Let's go check out inside. All right. We'll come inside here. And we'll take a look. This is a uh, this actually opens up into a, a full couch, a wraparound couch, which makes a with a nice little table underneath. You can't see the table because it's tucked down and the pillows are centered. Then I got this mattress stretched out. Above here, you've got a little um, uh, storage area that folds down to make a bunk bed as well. But it's awfully small. It's too small to use for a bunk bed. And we'll wrap around here. And we've got our little kitchen dinette. So you got a sink, stove, some storage underneath. And then on top we have some more storage. Paper towel holder. There's a this is a 96, so it has a cassette player, no CD. This is kind of cool. This was a single bed in the back. And what we did is we had a bunk bed, bunk bed made so that we could have someone else sleeping on top. And that mattress that you see here, that mattress actually goes up on top of the bunk bed, but I have it stretched out. So it goes there. That was all nice made. Uh, we have a refrigerator here. And then some more storage there. Let's check out this bunk bed. Obviously, uh, the bunk bed takes up half the window. When a uh, uh, camper comes with the bunk beds, you have two windows on the side. But uh, this works very well for us. Over here, we have our bathroom. It's got, uh, this is a brand new floor that was all installed. And we have a shower. And a sink. That's the bathroom. And over here, we have storage area. There's a difference with, uh, between using the equalizer hitch and not using it. As you see, uh, as you can see, my pilot is sinking a lot lower on that back axle and the back springs without the equalizer hitch. I just took it off so I can back it into the parking spot. Makes a big difference, everybody.